Alaskan Bush Family is a reality show in Discovery that mostly is the documentation of survival in the wilderness, but it always sends a subtle message of family bonds. While the Browns are a pretty close-knit family, one member among them has been pretty estranged from the rest of the bunch, and that is none other than the oldest son, Matt Brown. After a long struggle with addiction and then rape allegations, Matt Brown went incognito on us but resurfaced shortly before his father's death and has been very vocal since. After his return, he has made some pretty appalling allegations of the bodies responsible for his misfortunes. But firstly, a look back into his addiction. It started in 2016 and after a couple of years, it got so bad that he had to be pushed away from the show. I could see myself spiraling, Matt admitted to people at the time. I was more withdrawn. I was slower. Things didn't excite me the way they used to. After spending 35 days at an inpatient treatment center, Matt turned his weakness into a strength. In life, we all get lost every now and then and have to find our way back, he shared. Not everyone makes it back, and I'm happy to be one of those who did. We miss him terribly but would rather lose him from home for a little while than lose him forever, Billy told People. We just want him to do what he needs to do to get better. Since then, Matt stayed in California for at least until 2020, working on his sobriety. Face your fears. It will be okay. I love you. Matt stated on March 21, 2021, in a video celebrating his one-year sobriety after relapsing three times over the last three years. So I wanted to tell everybody if life is rough for you, or if these hard circumstances that we're all in right now have caused you to slip or relapse, or even just to get into a mindset that you don't like, it's human. That happens to all of us and it's going to be okay. In an April 11 video now, Matt has accused the filming and production crew for a lot of his troubles. Everybody's told me that other people's secrets aren't mine to tell, but they're destroying me and they've been destroying me for a long time, he opened in the almost 10 minute video. I'm cold and I don't have any money and I hardly have anything to eat. He says that the showrunners at first pitched the show to Discovery with a bogus impression of how the family really carried on with their lives, leaving out that the family had a generator, TV, and utilized power sporadically. Furthermore, he even made a huge claim that the production would further encourage his drug habits by supplying the family with drugs, including cocaine. He asserted he doesn't have anything to his name and is truly battling to make a decent living, notwithstanding the show's rewarding achievement. We made a lot of money off the show and because my dad controlled everything, all the money went to him, he said, alleging that his family kept more than $300,000 from him, specifically. I didn't have any money or anything. My dad kept that all. Discovery or the rest of the Brown family is yet to weigh in on all these allegations. <laughs>